Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you are all doing well. Okay, today we are going to be doing a bubble tea thrift store. Now, of course, I wanted to do it on a small lot. It was nice. It was good and I was like okay we can kind of make it like fall because we're starting to get in the fall season make it kind of like a like barn that has some like fruit that's selling outside the store you know of course in my fashion I tore it apart <laughs> and I put it on a bigger lot. I mean, it wouldn't be a inspiration build if I didn't do this, right? Like, <laughs> I mean, for those of you have, who have been around for a hot minute, girl, you know exactly what I'm talking about. I do this constantly and it's, I don't know if it's healthy or maybe I just want my creative juices to flow. Ew, that sounds disgusting. Oh, I just think it's more fun to build on something bigger because there's more room to play with. And like on, you know, on The Sims 4 build lot, you know, there's a lot you can do. So I just wanted to kind of mix between like a pumpkin patch meets like old spooky cartoonish type of like festival like and I just thought it'd be really fun because I used to go to a lot of them when I was younger and I have been starting to get into like the the fall feel I don't know I you know what I blame it on Bath and Body Works okay I blame it on them because I work in a mall I work at two jobs in the mall so I am always near that bloody Bath and Body Works place and they all have like their fall stuff up they have their Halloween stuff up and naturally I would just start gravitating towards it which is annoying because it's August okay we're starting to get into the cooler season I don't know where you're from but I'm from Canada so you know we're starting to get into like the cooler season but it's been hot so I don't know when that's gonna happen but <laughs> I love fall I love sweater weather I, sweater. I love sweater weather and I you know I walked past Bath and Body Works and I took a look at the stuff I smelt the warm apple pie I smelt the girlfriend I smelt the pumpkin pecan waffles okay and I grabbed all of them Bruh. I grabbed all of them and um I'm disappointed. Oh. I'm, I'm not mad. I'm just disappointed. But I got like this really cute like tree that like lights up and then I have like a pumpkin apple like bath bomb and I got some ghoul friend like hand sanitizer and I have like another candle holder from like last year that like lights up and glows and there's like little little like oh, like little ghost things floating around like it's just great and I love it and it's so bad because it's not even October. We have September, October. January, February, March, April, May, June. Jason Derulo. And fun fact, my birthday is in October. So maybe that's why I like fall so much in Halloween because I'm just like an October baby. Maybe. I don't know. What holiday do you guys love? I love Halloween. I've always loved Halloween. It will forever be my favorite. I love Christmas too. Don't get me wrong. I love like giving gifts to people because I just find it like really satisfying and fun and just oh, like open it already. But <laughs> I love Halloween and for some reason I just got into it. A lot of like the fall kind of things were just calling to me, you know, and the lighting. Okay, I cannot stress enough the lighting in the new high school world kills me and you know why I think the reason why it's so like contrasted you know what I think I think it's because it's to make the colors pop when I mean by pop I mean by like the spooky um walk through house the carnival rides like everything like the ferris wheel because I noticed when I went dark in like nighttime in another world when I was trying to build this it wasn't like as vibrant like the colors weren't as vibrant it wasn't as nice I didn't really get like that festival feel but in the new worlds 
the reason I think, and this is just a theory. A game theory. The reason that everything, like the color is so contrasted and so dark and so harsh is to really make the colors pop when you're on the boardwalk. That's what I think. You can let me know. Maybe it was just like a thing where they're like, oh, we want to get that like, like dark feel. But really though, like I can't see a reason why they would make that world specifically pop with color if it wasn't for something that needed to be popped with color. So I don't know, but I, I, that's the only thing I can come up with. I really wish it wasn't so, like, dark. I haven't even played the game yet, really, you guys. I have just been building, and I really, really, Willy, Willy Wonka. <laughs> I really want to play, and I want to make our Let's Play. I just, I need to figure out who I want in this family. If you guys haven't commented on the last ones before when I asked, if you want to do so now too, if you have any ideas, girl, of what you would like to see, I want to try and hear everything from everyone and just kind of like choose what ones I think would really suit my Sims and kind of go from there. And I'm just really, really curious. I want to build a whole Let's Play. I just haven't gotten to it yet. But I I promise I will and I'm so excited to see like what we do with it I'm really really like curious I am again also getting into like the whole spooky vibe and I know in my uh, in my channel a really long time ago when I first started doing my like builds I think it was like Halloween or something because I did the monster house from like the horror movie like monster house like that cartoon thing and then I also did the real conjuring house not the conjuring house in the movie but like the real house that it was based off of um and I did that and it was like Halloween even though I guess back then I only did two and I tried to do it all week and I just wasn't I just didn't have enough time, but I know now I probably would, so I would definitely do Halloween and every day of the week leading up to Halloween. And I don't know, I don't know if I should save this until October or I should just post it now. I don't know. Well, I guess, I guess we'll find out soon whether or not it's October and you see this now or if it's... I don't know, or if it's like August and this is happening, because I did mention it was August, so I guess it would be a little confusing if it was, you know, October. But any spooky suggestions would make my day. I'm just so excited. I love Halloween. I love spooky season, which is funny because I don't even like horror films. I think it was like nowadays I like horror films to an extent. Um, but when I was younger, I couldn't even watch Jumanji. Like, I classify the original Jumanji as a horror film. So let that sink in for a second, okay? I, <laughs> I was scared. And the one with Robin Williams, and I just thought it was so scary. And I was such like a little baby back then. And, <laughs> which is okay, because I thought it was adorable that I was scared of it, but... I I don't know. I like spooky things. I'm so into like haunted stuff and everything. So if you guys have any types of, I don't know, stories that you guys have, I let me know in the comments down below because when I do like a Halloween build, I want to read out everyone's Halloween stories of everything that has happened to them, like ghost experiences, freaky things that have happened. I think that would be such like a really cool like thing we could do for the people who don't, who haven't watched this video yet or you know the people who aren't watching this one right now. I will make a post later in October and I will say, hey, I'll let your girl know all the like little things. I'll, I'll do a reminder um, in October. You guys don't have to do it now, but I will write down everything if you guys have a story in mind. So I will write that down and we will kind of have like a, I don't know, like a like a story, a story time, and I think it'd be really fun. And I'm, oh, I'm so excited for that now. I have to write that down. I have to write all this down so I don't forget because I would forget 
I would totally forget and lose my head if it wasn't attached to it. But I really do hope that you guys like this build so far. It's definitely like really cute and the fun thing is is that you know you can't take the boardwalk into a different world right but you can with this and I really hope that you like it. I hope you get like the the Halloween spooky feel like bringing your family over and just enjoying the pumpkins and and maybe like a carving station which I think would be really cute and I just I love it. I love Halloween and I want to make so many more spooky builds and also a tip make sure to maybe put like the uh what's it called like I guess like the lava lamps everywhere because lighting is everything girl okay putting lighting in like purples to blues to greens anything like that it makes a world of a difference and it just brings your builds to a next level type of thing and i just think it is so fun but super weird i I, when I was saving this to the gallery, at first, the first couple pictures that it saved, it looked normal, like it looked fine. And then when I started to save it afterwards, it was like panning over to like the left, to like the ground, it was super weird. So I don't know, hopefully by the time that I have this on the gallery, it will be a little bit better. Um, which is super weird it's super weird i don't know but in the back you can see i did make like a little kind of shack i guess where you can get bubble tea and you can go to like the thrift store and you can go get like some clothes and just listen to stuff and i just think it is great like just having that like actual functionality there too if you want to go like see things and there's places to sit and eat and let me know if you guys have any spooky stories to tell your girl because I will be showcasing it at my builds on Halloween so please stay tuned for that because I'm so excited and thank you guys so freaking much for what are we at 4.42k subscribers oh my gosh our little family is growing thank you all so much for the love and support you guys are wonderful i love listening to like what you guys have to say any like advice um even just like telling me how your day is it just makes my day so thank you all so freaking much again i'm thinking that whenever I might do like a showcase Saturday or a showcase Sunday soon. So if you guys want me to see your builds, maybe do the hashtag see Simspo and I will try and, you know, I'll look on the gallery and maybe we'll do like a showcase Saturday or a showcase Sunday. Yeah, I think I can't wait. So I really hope that you guys like this video. Maybe if you please consider like, commenting, and subscribing and I will see you guys all later. Bye guys.